Hey Scorpios, welcome back to Star of the Universe Tarot. We are doing the What You Need to Know in the next 72 hour reading. If you do not follow me on Instagram, feel free to. I go live every Sunday for live general and love week ahead readings. I also go live for the new moon and the full moon readings. I do like a mini uh, energy um, update in the beginning of those videos um, to kind of take a moment to talk about what other transits what other transits and stuff are going on that may affect you or the manifesting there isn't any Okay, so, sorry. <clears throat> yeah, with the little mini energy update in the beginning to kind of check out the transits and how it will affect what you're manifesting. And Okay. Let's just jump into this before we don't have, like, <laughs> we don't get a chance to. I feel like somebody is trying to stop you, Scorpio, from doing something that you know you want to do. I feel like somebody's trying to stop you, um from taking the leap of faith here or um i'm hearing crocodile tears yeah look nonsense you could be dealing with um with the queen of wands here or like an uh, a low vibrational like an empress in the, in the reverse so you could be dealing with the libra taurus or an aries here but someone just can't figure out the right way to deliver um some kind of communication here. I feel like somebody's trying to stop a brand new beginning here. Like I said, with curiosity meets opportunity and learning to create what you desire. Like I said, some I feel like somebody's trying to inter intercept somebody's messages here, Libra. With its always tea time. Uh, eternity endless moments and re repetition this is like my nine of wands here like somebody has been caught doing this over and over and over again and it may have um it may have it may be that the justice system might be involved now with the laws not justice rules that are not fair you could be dealing with the libra again but someone scorpio in your life is purposely causing you imbalance Yeah, possibly, uh, possibly a Virgo here with the Nine of Pentacles under the deck. But also, it could just be somebody wants to see you single. Like, if I can't have you, nobody can type shit. Okay, yeah, but you have, a, you have the Wheel of Fortune that popped out. You could be dealing with the Leo, but this person, I feel like, could kick, cry, beg, scream, whatever they want. But... You're not like you ain't you don't give two fucks. Yeah, no, because this is the end of a um this is an end of a cycle here. Like you're no longer giving to this situation. You could be dealing with an Aquarius, a Leo, a Taurus, or um a fellow Scorpio. Yeah, but this person's reckless behavior has put you in this position before. Um you could be dealing with a Pisces and Aqua or um or an Aries again. But you refuse to take a leap of faith with this person because they're always um, behind a mask here. Yeah, this person could um, probably want to invest in a home with you. With um, with the four of wands here um, to try to offer some kind of apology or a brand new beginning. Um, but you're not sure how, how this communication is going to come in. Like, this person is infamous for, um, yeah, I'm hearing for their rotten communication. Yeah, you, but you have the love card under the deck, and then you have the soldier card, and then you have surprise. I think that somebody's going to surprise you. Um, you may um, be dealing with the fire sign or somebody from, from your past here, Scorpio, but I feel like someone was divinely guided um, to heal and come back and fight for this. Yeah, like after, after with room with the room card here, I I feel like after much separation, this per, like a long time of healing and separation, this person has decided that you're actually their sweetheart, and they want to invest in this with the gift and the scholar card. Yeah, 
Yeah, because they want to balance things out with you with the Six of Pentacles. And then once again with the house card here, like somebody wants to build bridges because they knew that they were childish in the past. And they could have blocked you or ghosted you with the Nine of Wands here again. But this person secretly always knew that you were their wish fulfillment. And this is what caused them a tower moment again and again and again. Actually keeping them from their Ten of Pentacles. Yeah, and this could have, this may have um, caused some kind of arguments in the past with the Knight of Swords under the deck. I think you have the Knight of Swords twice. Yeah, look. You have the Knight of Swords twice here. It's like this person only comes with swift communication, but when they come, it's like, like swinging. I'm, I'm, I'm getting like the image of like swinging by on a, like on a vine, like Tarzan. Like this person just like, as quick as they come, that's as quick as they're gone. Yeah, but I feel like for a long time you thought that this person was like juggling two uh, opposing lifestyles here. But this person was really just trying to balance themselves out because they had so much going for them at the same time. I feel like this person was really invested um, in their car career and finances, Scorpio. And um, the reason why this person's coming back so hard is because they feel like they're out of options here, that they have no... They have no other choice but to communicate. Yeah, because if not, then you guys are going to be stuck. There won't be any, there won't be success. But you guys are, but you guys are, can both agree that with the six and the six here that this love is divinely guided into, and it will be divinely guided into this healing process with the temperance card here with Sagittarius. Yeah. And then once this healing occurs you're definitely gonna have um somebody who's emotionally expressive towards you You have the king of cups twice and then right with the king of cups next to the temperance card like i feel like this was meant to be it was just meant to be and even after all the hidden factors and all the you know spying and tower moments after tower moments um probably dealing with some kind of karmic um completions here with the um with the lovers card which is like your third six, by the way. So you have six, 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 six out on the board right now. Like this person is done dealing with obsessive tendencies. This person doesn't want to deal with people who have toxicity in them. Like I feel like, like the devil card upside down. Like if this person thought that they were going to indulge in anything that wasn't um, for their highest good, like not only do they have like a team of ancestors in their ear, to be like no stop get the fuck away this person has enough common sense and has done enough healing within themselves to know that i'm just gonna separate myself from this because i know better this is um like there is an opportunity here with um not justice and um not fair is being very highlighted to um highlighted to me so i just feel like you could have possibly dealt with um, dealt with a, a Libra in the past, Scorpio, but there was an opportunity that came that came by and passed you by because this person was being unfair unfair to you, and there may have been a time where you could have healed it in the past and like still had this person as a part of your life, but I feel like this. Um, this person self-sabotaged way too much with the nine of um with the knight of wands here like i'm telling you just repetitive um repeating their mistakes again and again and that's what actually allowed you to make the final decision with the two of pentacles here to 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 find that success on your own and heal yourself and basically call in new love that's what i'm seeing here scorpio all right let's get a dragon oracle The orange and gold dragon from Articus opens you to the knowledge for the new golden age. Carry the energy of the future and be the guiding light. 
Yeah, you. That's what you decided to do. I'm telling you, you're you're your own light at the end of the tunnel. Like, there's nobody that you need to depend on. There's nobody that you feel like needs to have that authority over you except for yourself. I feel like you're recla uh, you're definitely reclaiming your authenticity here, and I feel like you're calling back your power as well, Scorpio. And I I feel like you didn't even know that this this part of you was restrained for so long, but I think. Even you've noticed that you've been emotionally disconnected and non-expressive lately that it took you a moment to actually for the fire to actually hit or the aha moment, the epiphany to finally fly that, oh, okay, I see what's going on here and correct the situation. There you are. Okay, let's read the guidance message. You have, it is not by chance you have incarnated during this extraordinary 20 year period when our planet is undergoing double a double dimensional shift. Earth needs spiritual leaders and light bearers. These dragons are blazing their light towards you for it holds the vision of our fifth dimensional future. They are inspiring you to do your part for the new golden age on earth receiving this card indicates that it is time to stand in your power and fulfill your destiny allow the orange gold dragons from articus to enter your energy fields and breathe into your into you the vision of earth as it will be they will give you the strength wisdom and knowledge that you will need for the transformation ahead you you have much to do and many people to help and a beautiful seventh dimensional orange gold dragon from Articus will stay by your side so long as you need it being the guiding the guiding beacon to the to light the way for many there you go Scorpio so that's what you did you cleared I feel like a lot of past life karma with a lot of uh, I think we had the ton of pentacles under the deck yeah like a lot of Akashic record cleaning cleaning and clearing um, somebody could have probably tried to bind themselves to your Akashic Records here. But you are divinely guided to be moved up and out of their energy field anyway. So anything that they thought that they could do to delay it or to try to stop it in any way, shape, or form, that's just not going to happen. Alright Scorpio, I hope this helped. Bye.